Hey y'all, do y'all want a fake how to get a blowout? This is a fake blowout look. I did not blow dry this hair, I curled it. But it looks like I went to the salon and got a blowout. And so I'm gonna show you right quick how to do that. Okay, so since I already did this, it's gonna kinda look already pretty, but make sure your hair's all the way dry and grab the biggest barrel curling iron you have. This is a really old one by Conair that I have, and I'm almost positive this is a two inch, but it could be a one and a half. It doesn't say it anymore. It's probably worn off. But the bottom, you're gonna section off the top, go to the bottom, and do exactly how you would if you had curlers. You're gonna hold it like so, and then let it go through the barrel and let it drop. And it's just gonna be a big curl. Because you have a big barrel, it's gonna be a big curl. You're gonna do it all over. Just bring it like you would if you had curlers in your hair. Just place it right there. Don't put it. After you're done that section, grab the next section. I just grabbed it like this much. Pull it down and grab. Take your curling iron. And since this is going to be a little bit higher up on your head, make sure it is horizontal, exactly where you would place a curler. Just like I showed you at the bottom here, you're gonna do it right where it lives, where the hair lives. And then let the hair go through and let it fall. You're gonna do it all the way around. It doesn't matter if you see a crease by your um, hairline right here nobody's gonna see that and just bring it like you would a curler let it set for a few seconds and then let it pop through okay so now that you have that section done bring the top section down and you're going to do the middle here and when you do the mohawk section you're going to want to put it just like you would, and I'm gonna sound like a broken record, just like you would a roller. And you're going to curl it and let it set here. Do you see how I have this? Let it set and let it pop through. Even if it looks like it's a little curl, it's okay, it's going to drop. And then when you get, you're gonna do this whole mohawk section just like that. When you get to your bang area, even if you have even bangs to, you wanna be very careful on how you do the bang area. You don't wanna go to the hairline because you wanna preserve how your hair flows. So you're gonna do just like that and let it fall. So all you did was do the middle up and I'll show you that one more time so you can really see. This is the very front section. You're gonna pull it through just like that. So then your whole head looks like you just went to a stylist and had it blown out. And if you want more volume here, let's say this is hair that you slept on, you can just got grit, rub it all over your hands. Make sure you work it in really good so that you have dry, not oily hair that looks like it's got volume and that it's been freshly blown out. And that is how you do that. Catch me next time. This is your makeup, not makeup, this is your hair tip for the day. Bye.